All right, guys, uh, today I'm going to be doing a product review on these uh, Caprice uh, plastic inserts, or chips, and they're sold on eBay or on Instagram. Um, the guy's name is uh, on Instagram, at Gordo underscore parts. And he sells these, and these are the honey gold, uh, like the original type, uh, and then he has different colors. It's a variety of them, but you guys could... Uh, Go ahead and uh, look them up on Instagram. And I know he sells them on, fa not Facebook, but uh, eBay. Show you guys who I am. I'm on Instagram, at ImpalaMike underscore. Business card. Back of my business card. I've had this uh, card for years, so it's been the same. Very little changed on it. And... What I did was uh, I got a 75 Caprice header panel emblem, which I already cleaned up and I already got one of the uh, chips off. And, you know, I wanted to learn how to do it first before I did it on film. And let me show you. I tried to use a screwdriver, a pick, and I even tried a, a box cutter. I don't know if you guys could see that. But what I, what I personally found, uh, what I used was a pocket knife. And I already had one of them pulled off already, and I cleaned the surface, and I still willed the whole thing. Um, these are things I'm going to be using to put it on. The silicone. And it's like for something at uh, Home Depot, and you guys can get those. And then also, if you guys need to get still wool, it's always good to have that, the cleanup emblem and trim. Let me see here. Still wool, it's a little bag of it. This one, I always like to use the three and sometimes uh, two. Never, I never rarely use four. But that's this stuff right here. Okay, so I already got one of them off. Um, right here, I already pulled one of them off. And you can see, see that? That was the original silicone that was on there. Where it's all clear. So I got the new ones that when you get them in the bag, this is how they come. And they all, he also has them for these, uh, I, I'm not gonna do the review on these cause it's the same thing, but for the Fender Emblem, 75, 70, uh, 75, 76 Caprice. Um, let's see here. You always wanna test fit before you put the silicone. That's a good fit. That looks nice, big difference. And the reason why I was changing them because the discoloration uh, it, like turned silver the original is, uh, should be gold, but it has a crack right here. And this guy's gonna be for sale. Take this out. Let's see here. I can't take it out. Wait. There it goes. Cause I, I you know, you wanna test fit it before you put silicone. Always with everything, always test fit. And then this guy, I'll show you guys how I took it out. Move both of these. Kind of, I know it's kind of dangerous with the knife, but the other stuff that I use, it, it just, it wasn't getting it. And you know what? Obviously on some of them, they just pop right out easy. But if you could tell, this one has been on there for a minute. This is, uh, well, from the factory. This one is on there good. And you're gonna have struggles with on some of them, but other ones that you're probably missing them. They've already popped off, but I already know just just a little bit of that silicone is gonna keep it for a lifetime. Damn, I think I made a little bit of a spot right there. Yeah, see that? So this is some of the struggles you're gonna do to get it off. You know, some of, them, some of them are missing, some of them are real easy. They've been out in the elements in the weather. So see that? That's the original silicone that's on there right there. And that's, so that goes to tell you when you go to put these on, they're gonna be on for a lifetime and it's not completely covered. That's fine. You know, what would you rather have on your car? Look at the back too, it's like a chrome look that right there that's way better okay let me put the old ones to the side and i want to clean the surface up this old silicone 
I know I look a little sketch with that knife, but you know, I was trying to be careful. You know, whatever you, uh, you're comfortable with, your process, and that's fine. You know what, use it, but try to be safe. Don't point the knife at you. So if it lets go, and then let's see here. Just about got it all off. I'm gonna blow this off. A little rag, wipe it down. And I'm gonna test fit this one as well. Okay, I don't wanna shove it all the way down and get it stuck like the other one did. Um, silicone. I already got this open. You're gonna to have to open the little tip. You know, you cut it with a box cutter or a knife. It says on the instructions, it tells you how to do it, to put a pea size. I think that should be enough. All right. Because it's like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Once you smash it down, it squishes out. And you don't want it to be squishing out. See how much I put on there? Not that much. And you know, for, uh, I think it doesn't tell you to do it, but you don't have to do it. But, uh, you know, I always like to do extra. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of tape on there, come back to it. And you don't wanna see the silicone coming out. It's gonna hold it from the back. You'll be fine. And you don't wanna move it on the instruction it says, once you put it on, you don't wanna move it. So I'm just gonna let it sit here. It says 30 minutes for the silicone. Um, it says, it, uh, what does it say? It, it says it, yeah, 30 minutes right here on this line, 30 minutes. So, you know what, 30 minutes, an hour, whatever, but I got it, and it actually looks way nicer compared to that. Yeah, and look at already, it's a, it's a nice emblem. It's ready, ready to go. This one's for sale. And imagine this, you know, when you really want to get detailed with it, you know, you may not want to chrome it. Uh, still will the heck out of it, and you may want to use a little pick to clean all this out. Same thing with this guy. Then you could detail that out. Make it look nice like factory. Originally, this was black in here. But anyways, guys, thank you. Uh, give a like, share, and subscribe. 